One token is one bottle of wine. This is the world's first wine-backed crypto asset. My name is Mike Barrow. I'm a wine producer. In 2003, I bought a piece of land in Mendoza, Argentina and planted a vineyard. At the same time, I've been working as an IT engineer in different parts of the world and, and now bringing those two worlds together. Open Vino is a collection of processes and some software that we're developing and documentation that we're sharing with the world. All of this designed to explore this experiment of how to create an open source company and how to tokenize wine. I think there's a lot of really interesting projects and products that are coming out of the blockchain space but they're very esoteric in many ways and people want to see something that's tangible, right? A bottle of wine is something we all understand. And I think there's a real need for cryptocurrencies that have some relation to things that people can understand. You know, the idea of an open source winery comes from the open source movement and software. And it's really that we can see a definite advantage of value of being transparent, of sharing, of connecting on a different way with the people that are drinking our wines. And the whole point of this is to explore different business models that the blockchain and cryptocurrencies allow us to do. Open Vino is a big experiment. Uh, we don't know exactly how the data that we're collecting will be used, uh, both from the vineyard or from the consumer, or how the token price is gonna change. Um, but let's wait and see.